just act like we belong here and know we are not like enemies. We're just two of the masters. A slow moving swinging object? Oh my god! Did it just kill him too? Yeah, it just, it almost killed the, the archer too. Yeah, look at him go, limping away. That is the Get most amazing here. box ever. Guards! You are a guard, you retard. You won't make it. Ah, damn, you are here. Alright, now that I've done that part again, let's continue on. Luckily, you can use arrows, and they won't go, Oh, I know where the source of that is immediately. They will actually go, Huh, I heard something, and go and investigate. It's it's still kind of stupid, but it's less stupid than when they go, I heard something. You're right there! It's also nice that when someone's down, and they're, Oh, getting back up. Uh, hitting them will actually knock them partially back down, so that way you can come up, swipe somebody, and then do your finishing blow. The finishing blow is supposed to actually kill them, but apparently it's not 100% effective. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I would have been able to destroy that eventually. This first section's, you know, not, not especially exciting, but it's there. Okay, back again. It turns out uh, those last few parts, which you just watched, are going to be part of part three, which is this, which you probably already know since the video is going to have that title. So, this is part three. Hello. A little late to say that, but you know, it's uh, I said it. That's what counts. So we're here in the garden, and this guy was apparently left to guard the fertilizer heap. Except now he will become fertilizer. Come on. Unless I don't have that ability yet. Hang on. Oh, I don't Did have I the backstab ability yet. Oh crap. Don't move, buddy. You're a dead man. Yeah. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> I turns out I'm not I'm not especially that good at uh, close quarters combat. But lighting people on fire is always fun. Hey you. You go with your friends. God, you're all so incompetent. Let me organize this a little. Daggers, then sword, then bow. And these will go on the end. Apparently pressing E will actually equip what you have, so like them. Okay, so I got my sword. Keep looking. Let you need in. to get inside and secure the crystal. Now, I'm kind of annoyed that you can't actually pick everything up like you used to be. I mean, like you can in most, uh, Steam, or Source Engine games. It's depressing, I can't, like, pick up that wagon wheel and check it up. I can only pick up certain approved objects. Oh, well. Making progress. Loading times in this game are extremely long, even, I mean... I have uh, stuff running in the background, but even if you don't, the, the loading times when it actually has to give you a loading bar take take inside at last. Time. Good job. Let's see what's going ah, on. Ah, there we go. I would like to be able to backstab, but apparently that's that's not available right now.
don't really want to do jack of all trades. So let's just do that. Stick with the two. Well, the few options we have here. What was that? What was that? You know, it's probably those big spiders you have lying around. See? Big. Of course, you know when you see that they used a model for a large spider like that, you know you're gonna actually have to fight large spiders later. You know what? Okay, fine. I'm just gonna... Did I oh, now you come here! I realized when I was watching my other videos again, the reason they're probably not dying when I'm doing my finishing blows is I'm playing on hard now. So probably they take just a little bit more to actually keep down. Sure I will, especially when I can headshot you from here. A little bit of frame rate lag. What was that? Oh, I haven't played in a while. I've been playing other games with bows and arrows, and I'm ah, oh, I'm out of practice on exactly how far it falls. There we go. Show some Is that enough skill for you? Now you got an arrow coming out of both sides of your head. Well, see, it doesn't do like oblivion and actually keeps the arrows stuck in the head. Oil jar. Oh, these are fun. What these do is you can actually spread oil around. He still gives me the shakes. You've met him? Yes, and I wish I hadn't. What's he like? Like a nightmare made of ice. That's what he's like. Nightmare made of ice. All right, that's a great descriptor there. Huh? Now you notice that little black patch on the ground where I didn't exactly want it, but it works. What that is... Ooh, frame rate. What are you doing to me? Did I hear something? Damn it. What it is, is oil. And what it does is it ignites. Unfortunately, it's being a little temperamental about it right now. It's probably because I hit the rafter. Best strategy is to kick everything. Especially since, you know, as long as you don't hit anything, it doesn't actually take any energy. Can I take... I, I really want to just take their armor and sneak around. I don't see why that's not an option. That really should be. Walk up the guys. Hey, how you doing? Hey, Phil. I just kicked the oil jar in midair. Normally that would be really kick ass, but kinda needed that oil well, wanted that oil jar. A little late now, aren't I? Never mind. Pretty good looting here. Much better than slim pickings to Morton Haven. I'll say. Hard to get excited over barrels of dried fish. That's another perk. The ghouls and zombies are too dumb to steal anything they can't eat. Urgash take the lot of them. Who knows what they want? Huh? Dang it. I am not doing too well here. There we go. See, now it ignites on the ground and becomes a pretty, pretty big hazard to most bad guys. <sighs> I am not being, doing very well at this game. I am actually not that great at uh, first-person games in general, but I am actually surprised at myself at just how badly I'm doing right now. <laughs> 
fish. A leak. Ah, come on. Well, that was a pathetic sound for such a giant jar. Um, is this a dead end? Oh, I came from down there, that's why. Stop right there, or it gets loud. You notice the the uh, the guards aren't exactly the greatest voice actors, nor do they have the widest variety of things to to say. get decapitated or anything. Where's the fun in that? The throwing is really off in this game. I mean, you'll aim right here and it'll it'll hit either way closer to you than you meant or way higher. Uh, now this section's fun. Ropes like this pretty much always mean there's a trap nearby. Unfortunately, the trap didn't work very well. There we go. Don't even notice the giant swinging chandelier there. You won't make it. Damn, he was an idiot. Oh, hey there. You're a dead man. See, and that's why. If you see a rope tied to something, right immediately there. shoot it or hack it or something. It makes combat a whole lot easier. Show some skill, Did I just kill him with this? I love this jar. This is this jar is oh, I was gonna say it's the new radio, but now it's gone now. Have to be kind of careful because that thing will eventually it breaks and smashes the uh, smashes the throne. Ah! I mean, it's already clipping through it. You think it would have broken it already? Now that uh, thing you saw climbing the walls—that's what's called a ghoul. Um, those don't show up in Heroes 5. I'm not really sure why they exist in this. They could have used something a little cooler, but uh, that was supposed to be a hint to, you know, follow it. Because you see it climbing the wall, and oh my gosh, that should be interesting to you, right? Wizard robe. It's Mage Affinity 1. Adds 1 to armor and 10 mana. Where is Mage Affinity 1? Ah, there we go. Magic Affinity. Uh, increases max mana, which is always a good thing. Now, strange candelabra. You think that might be important? You're right. And that is the secret area sound. Which, strangely enough, I think is the exact same secret area sound as uh, one of the Jedi Knight games. Potion, fireball, scrolls. Ring of Arcane Brilliance. Which what it does is it adds 10 mana. It's not exactly helpful to me right now because I don't use mana all that much, but it will be handy in the future if I get more magic. Book of Ghouls. I don't know, are you even supposed to? Yeah, this must be like an optional room. I am lost. I've played this game like five times, and I still get lost every time. Ah, there we go. See, it broke eventually. And I've had it break before while I'm trying to use it to kill people, and that's not a good thing. And what do you know? I went over. I am going to cut out some of my stuff. <sighs> I really need to pay more attention. Sorry about all that. Um, apparently you've missed some content. Probably nothing good. Mostly me sneaking around. Uh, so I won this year. Goodbye.